Hello YouTube friends, I am here at Costco and I'm about ready to go in but I thought I would just say a quick hello if you are new here. My name is Meredith and welcome to my channel Marival Trades. Um, I do all kinds of unboxings here, beauty, lifestyle, and fashion and I also do a Costco haul every month and other grocery hauls and shopping hauls and whatever other shenanigans I happen to be up to. So if that sounds like a good time, hit the red subscribe button down below and we can hang out more often. I hope you guys are doing well and staying safe. And when I get done in Costco, I'm gonna show you what I got. Here is a quick overview of everything we got and let's dive right in. Okay, so they had the Kirkland brand bath tissue. So I picked up a pack of that. Yay, thumbs up, that is a good day. Um, we got some of the organic tortilla chips. These are our favorite. Absolutely love them, and I highly recommend those. We got some of the pretzel crisps for just general snacking. I picked up these Brain Quest workbooks for my kids. So I got one for my 10-year-old and one for my 8-year-old so that we can sort of work on things and make sure that they don't lose any, you know, anything they've learned over the school year um, during the summertime. So picked those up. I'm sure my kids will be so thrilled that, that, that I found those. Um, I did pick up a pack of bell peppers. I absolutely love bell peppers. They're one of my favorite, favorite, favorite veggies. So I picked those up. Those will mostly be for me um, and some fajitas. Uh, we got some of the organic apples for the kids to snack on. I got two things of Go-Gurts. My kids love these and they're great to throw in the freezer. Um, we got lots of nice, cool things. We don't have central air in our house, and so I live in Minnesota, by the way, uh, if, you're, if you're wondering about this. And um, so we just have one of those wall air conditioner units, and it does not keep the house particularly cool, so we like to have lots of cold treats. So yeah, we got some organic raspberries. Had to talk to a kiddo for a second. And then I got two packs of the Driscoll's strawberries. These, uh, my kids will just inhale. They are delicious. And if for any reason I'm worried about the strawberries going bad or the raspberries, I can wash them up and stick them in a container and throw them in the freezer. I did get some of the Welsh's organic juice ice bars. Again, popsicles for summertime. Who doesn't love those? These looked really good. So these are some really nice looking heirloom tomatoes. And I think these will be so good sliced up for sandwiches. And who knows, maybe I'll do like a pasta dish with some penne and tomatoes and like red onion. That'd be good. I did pick up another pack of the hard salami. We have gotten this before and we really like it. I like that there are two packs. So you can cut them in half, open them up, and you know, the other one stays fresh. I did get a three pack of cucumbers. I get this pretty much every single time I go to Costco. I did have to dig a little bit because the cucumbers on top were looking pretty sad, but um, really like those a lot. And again, my kids will inhale those. So this is an every time pretty much purchase for us. These, this is the Dubliner cheese from Kerrygold. We really like it. They had ground turkey in stock. <laughs> Can you tell I'm excited? It's really sad. This is how you know you're old is when you get excited about the fact that there's like chicken breasts, ground turkey, and toilet paper at your Costco. That is my life. So anyways, they had some ground turkey and this is our preferred meat of choice. So I picked some of that up and I also was able to get the skinless boneless chicken breasts as well. So it's a good day. We um, usually buy these both every month. So I'm going to just cut the packages and put them in the freezer like we usually do. These looked really yummy. These are the kosher dill Clausen pickle spears. I thought these would be good to go with our lunches and whatnot since we'll be eating more cold meals, you know, like cold cut sandwiches and pasta salads and anything I don't have to heat up the oven and therefore heat up the house with. We did get some of the organic extra virgin olive oil. Um, I use this for a lot of my cooking and I was just about out. They also had the organic basil leaves and the oregano. So I did pick up both of those. I use this for my pulled pork tacos that I do in the crock pot. So I'm gonna have to do those soon. That sounds really yummy. And then just 
you know, have some spices on hand. I'm getting low on a lot of my spices. I did pick up one of the Daisy Sour Cream. We use this for all kinds of things, cooking, baking, and tacos. I just made scones recently, and those called for sour cream, so I'll try to remember to link that cooking video at the end of this one in case you're interested. I've been doing some cooking videos lately. I got two of the 24-count eggs. These are the organic cage-free ones. These are the ones we normally buy, and we really like them. I got some of the organic Colby Jack cheese, and then I also picked up up two of the upside down Adams Reserve New York extra sharp cheddar we really like these for grilled cheese for sandwiches and the like I got some of the good culture cottage cheese I've really been liking this and Costco definitely has a really good price on it because um, this brand tends to be pretty spendy we got one 12 pack of the Nusa yogurts these are delicious the lemon flavor is my personal favorite um, and I did pick up some Always Ultra Thin. This is a 76 pack. I actually got these because I'm going to donate them. Um, I'm sure so many of you have probably heard about the riots in Minneapolis and a lot of stores were looted, damaged, or burned down. And so um, a lot of people in that area have nowhere to shop. So I did pick up a few other things and we have some stuff in our house as well that I'm going to take up there. So we got a two, uh, this is two bags of the Cheez-Its. My kids love those. I did also get some hand soaps to donate and some mac and cheese as well. Um, these are 18 individual boxes, so I'm going to put a few of them in my pantry and take the rest um, to donate. We got some buns. We can use these for sandwiches. These are the brioche deli style buns. And well, sandwiches and burgers and um, also the chicken strips, which I'll show you in a minute. So chicken sandwiches for dinner are super yummy as well. We got two boxes of the organic Triscuits. These are delicious. We use these for lunches and snacking and all kinds of things. We got some of the organic fruit and vegetable pouches. My daughter loves those and we go through them like crazy. We got some more butter just to have on hand. I got some bananas. These ones are looking a little sad, but that's okay because I plan to freeze about half of them sliced up to be able to put in smoothies. And my kids just really like to eat frozen banana circles is what they call them. So got those. We also picked up some of the tortillas. This is a pretty much every time purchase for us. We really like them. I got some Authentic Uncured Canadian Bacon. This is the Maple Leaf brand. We um, chop these up and put it in scrambled eggs, do breakfast sandwiches, um, and yeah, so it's actually a two pack. That's two separate packs, so I'm going to probably put one of those in the freezer. Speaking of freezer things, okay, so I had gotten these last time because they didn't have just good old chicken breasts at Costco, and several of you commented and told me how great they are, and I have to agree. So these are the uncooked panko chicken breast tenderloins, and if you put these in the oven, they are a really nice, uh, well-breaded chicken tenderloin, obviously, um, but they make for really good sandwiches so if you're not going out to eat but you like those like crispy chicken sandwiches that a lot of restaurants have put some mayo and lettuce and a slice of tomato on there and it's pretty darn good so I those get my seal of approval you might want to try them I did pick up one thing of formula this is the Kirkland brand this is what we use for our kids and um, I'm going to donate this as well because our kids don't need it they are all much older than that now we got some Johnny Pops these are really good. I have to say I absolutely love the strawberry flavor especially. So there are the fudge ones, the chocolate fudge with uh, fresh cream and the strawberries with fresh cream. Those are really good. My kids are going to be super pumped because I got these drumstick uh, variety pack. It's got the vanilla fudge, vanilla, and vanilla caramel, which is my personal flavor. I am a big sucker for caramel. So these are going to be delicious, and I got to finish this video so I can get them in the fridge, <laughs> or the freezer, I mean. We got some of the Kirkland cheese pizzas. We do pizza night every week, so that's going to be great. We did try, grabbed these new ones. Huh, I can't talk today. I grabbed these new Authentic Motor City Pizza Company double pepperoni uh, Detroit style deep dish pizza. This just looked really good and I thought it would be fun to just try something different and switch it up from the uh, Kirkland brand pepperoni pizzas. So let me know in the comments below if you want to know how we liked them and once we've tried them I will answer your comment. We got the organic bean rice and cheese burritos. My husband's been loving these for lunches and they're pretty darn good. So if you're looking for a nice vegetarian option, these are a good one. All right, and then we also picked up a pack of the AAA Duracell batteries. Don't mind my daughter, she's making noise <laughs> over here. Say hi, River. 
don't don't knock it over okay <laughs> so anyways batteries these are on sale we got a 44 pack of the microwave popcorn this is the movie theater uh, butter flavor my kids love to have this for bedtime snack I did pick up some of the Kirkland cold brew Colombian coffee I just wanted to try these out and several of you guys last time when I asked said they were really good we did pick up a pack of the Premier Protein. This is the caramel flavor. So I've seen several other YouTubers comment or talk about in their videos about how they get this cold brew coffee and they do one of these and a Premier Protein um, in the blender as like a frappuccino, frappe sort of thing um, and or just an iced coffee. So I'm hoping to do that because I just don't wanna drink hot coffee on summer mornings. So we'll see how this goes. And then the last thing I got is this two-pack of the Kingsford uh, Professional Charcoal. This one was, I think it was $14.99. You get two huge packs. So this will be enough to last us for the entire summer. All right. So that is everything whew, that I got at Costco this time. We had quite the haul. So thank you guys so much for watching. Definitely leave me all of your Costco favorites down below. And if you're new, tell me where you're watching from. I love getting to know you guys in the comments. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And you know I'll be talking to you soon. Bye, guys.